I think for parents it's a one-stop shop. You start there in kindergarten and you become part of the community and you're part of the community right through to year 12. So for 13 years as a parent you'll be part of the one community and so will your son and daughter. I'm cautiously calling it a blank slate because I know that there's a lot of work that has gone on there already. It's really about growing that and making sure the students have the best experience that they can have. It's all about the continuum. It's one school, one learning opportunity, one opportunity for growth. So we aim to, over those 13 years, we aim to know the child and grow the child. And we want parents to come and grow with us. Oh, what a bold and brave decision the amalgamation of the Asheville Precinct is. I feel that it's a, a response to a changing inner west situation where the community is looking for more, needs more, and for Sydney Catholic Schools to, to decide to, to create an educational setting that, that mimics what the world will be like for the students who pass through our doors in a co-educational amalgamated setting. There are really exciting opportunities in the new model for a whole range of different pathways that I'm really keen to explore with the new leadership team that I think will set our students up for great success in a, in a really dynamic uh, environment that exists outside of school. I'm currently employed as the Director of Admin and Curriculum at De La Salle and I wanted to be part of this new community and, and be able to set something up for the future that's going to be really good for our community and for the broader um, Sydney Catholic Schools community. Fostering a sense of empathy within our students, that understanding and appreciation of another's experience and another's emotional place, I think that's really important. So trying to be like Christ to another, if we can engender that in our students so that they can then leave to go out to make our world a better and more just place, then I think we've done very well. I want the girls and boys of St Vincent's to be good Christians and to be good citizens. I want them to learn to the best of their ability so that they can go forth in the world to be whatever they want to be. So I see the school as a beginning of that journey. I hope the grounding that we give them at St Vincent's will provide them the opportunities that they need.